banker. And that time he was able to maneuver around Rudy, get him off balance for a nice banker. 12 points on 11 shots by Brooks in the first half. Valanchunas is yet to score, but he's tossed out four assists. And Conley buries another three. T, the Jazz have hit 11 of 24 from downtown and in the first half. Yeah, I like the battle going on between Dylan Brooks and Mike Conley. Mike hit that three, and first person he looked at on a glance was Dylan Brooks. Bogey. Oh, yes! Bogdanovich. I tell you, he willed that three-point shot in. Brooks looks like he's bloodied after that run-in with Gobert, but Utah knocks down back-to-back -back threes and open up a 61-46 lead in game three. Well, you better believe it's going to get a little chipper. You saw Dylan Brooks looking to watch Mike Conley. Watch where, watch where he looks. If you can catch it right there at Dylan Brooks. No words need to be said. On the other end, on the other end, Dylan Brooks right here. Getting a little chippy. Did I say it wasn't personal? Oh, you bet it is. And it's business. There you go. There you go. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's starting, Bowler. Just getting underway in the second half. The Jazz have put 60 on the board with 2.15 left in the first half in game three. And I tell you, the power of the three. Back to back to back to back. Four straight three-point shots put down by the Jazz. Yeah, and that, there was some making up to do, right? You talked about the three turnovers that they had. Right? They, that just can't happen. you got to take care of the basketball. But uh, Jazz are doing awesome right now from the three. T time for an All-State Good Hands replay. And it's got to be Mike Conley. Controls a dribble with his right hand. Fires it down with his left.